When you first get your cap driver, you may need to adjust it to your machine. So with it loaded and with it selected in the software, uh, we're gonna go ahead and adjust it and make sure that it works well with your machine. Um, you're gonna need a tool to do that. The tool that you're going to need is this four millimeter driver. Um, looks like a screwdriver. It's a little bit different. Um, and then you'll need just a, a business card or two um, to help kind of gauge where that driver sets. And what we're going to do is adjust where this driver sits on your machine. So we are zoomed in and the adjustment screws that we'll be dealing with are here, 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 and here. So those are the ones that we need to look at. Um, to loosen them up, you can just come in with your driver and loosen them up. Now what we're looking for is a space right in here and this is where we're adjusting is how much space is between the driver and the lower arm so we're zoomed in really really tight and what we're looking for is the space between these two pieces where the ring almost meets the lower arm but we definitely don't want that to rub so we're looking for just a little bit of space in there um, ideally a business card maybe two is what we're looking for. So if I slide a business card in here, we're looking for it to slide smoothly back through and never touch. So to adjust it, I'm going to loosen up these screws. I can loosen them in any order. If you're having trouble getting the driver on in the first place, you could even consider loosening these before you put the driver onto the machine. And now I'm going to slide a couple of business cards under here. There we go. Just kind of let that rest on there. And then I want to make sure that these two pieces are even. If this is over to the side, and this isn't aligned to that bracket appropriately, I, I, that's going to be a problem. So I want to line up these two edges, one with the bracket and one with this piece here. Make sure that those are nice and aligned. And then I'm going to tighten these in a star pattern. Again, I'm using that four millimeter driver. There we go, and then I'm going to remove these cards and make sure that I have the space that I think that I should. So I'm looking for just a little bit of a gap. I'm looking for this gap right in here. Now, because the driver is curved and this little bit of the lower arm is flat, I don't wanna look right in the middle. I wanna look right where those two are the closest. So kind of here and kind of right here. It's enough to get two business cards in there. That's about what I'm looking for. Now that your driver is adjusted for your machine, you're ready to begin sewing uh, your caps or pocket clamps or any of those. Um, you don't need to adjust this every time. This is something you'll want to do uh, once per machine, per driver. Now, if you have multiple machines and multiple drivers, what I would consider doing is just getting a piece of tape or a label maker and uh, kind of lining that up with your machine and giving it whatever name you've named your machine or the serial number and just keeping your driver paired with that specific machine that it's adjusted to.